using Genius Scan, here are some top tips. First, ensure that when you put Genius Scan on, it's in batch mode. So in this top right hand corner here, um, it says batch. Then once you've taken your photos, you want to start editing them. So this icon down here is the one that will allow you to edit. So click on that. The next thing is to, is to recrop um, each page. So you want this icon here. If you click on this one, um, it will allow you to recrop. And you get this orange box and you drag the corners to the correct place. That's what I've done to you would drag those in as well. Once you've recropped, it should look like that. So it now fits the page nicely. You want to click on this option here for filters. Um, and filters is going to allow us to take it out of the photo format. So select black and white um, down here. That is your best one for filter. And it turns black and white, surprisingly enough. The next thing we're going to do is rename it because it gives you the date and time. So you're going to click on this bit up here and it will allow, allow you to rename your work, make it something sensible and then click on rename. Here we have mine has been renamed. Uh, we then need to um, do that for each page. Make sure it's all done. Each page has been cropped and put in black and white. Once you've done all that, click on the X down here because you finished editing. It goes back to the um, first page and you're going to want to then click on the share icon. And this is how we're going to actually submit your work. You can either submit it via email. So just click on email. It's already in PDF format, um, which is great. If you do this, email it to your school account, save it on your drive, and then you can upload the classroom as a nice PDF. Alternatively, you can scroll down and if I have the right slide on, you can scroll down and actually select Google Drive and you can upload it straight to your drive should your Google Drive be linked to the device you use Genius Scan on and then upload it to Classroom from there. Hopefully that's clearer than mud. Good luck.